Hi, Scott Deputy here, your local realtor safety and self-defense expert, back with the next video in our ongoing series of safety and self-defense tips, tricks, and proactive business practices. So today I wanna to talk about the very first and most important business practice that I believe will help keep you safer as you conduct your business as a real estate agent. And that is have an intake process for every prospective client that you work with. So for a buyer client, of course, that means having an intake process where you have a buyer questionnaire, where you do a buyer consultation and discuss the expectations, discuss your ground rules for engagement, which includes, do you work in the evenings after dark? Do you work on weekends? So you have an opportunity to articulate your value proposition as well as, as, well as set expectations with your new prospective client so that they understand what to expect as they go through the process with you. This is also your time to conduct an interview and have an intake process where you collect information about your client prospect, where you can verify identification, or perhaps even have a get to know you form where you're collecting some other personal information about their interests, their family, and their contact information, of course, which will help you build rapport and potentially gain a client for life over time. Seller client is the same thing. You want to have a pre-listing interview and questionnaire where you have an opportunity to interview and ask questions and get a sense of ownership with your potential seller client before you are actually visiting the property. In the case of the buyer consult, again, this needs to be at a third party location, whether that's at an office, a local coffee shop, or uh, via Zoom using technology. You need to have a preliminary consultation where you can get eyes on your prospect and have that intake process so that you're not just jumping in a car and going to meet a strange person in a strange place. So that is our tip number one, is to always, always have an intake process for your potential clients, buyers or sellers, where you have an opportunity to interview, consult and collect information prior to engaging them out in the field. I hope this is helpful and we'll look forward to seeing you in the next video.